Farm Guy here with an update to the Manti GX Force Special, but this is by HR Forst und Frozen Brau, 43.4 megabytes to download, and amazingly, only three slots on console now. This has come at the request of a valued viewer and friend of the channel, Mr. Smoke82, has requested that I review this mod now that is either because he wanted to see a review or he wanted to torture me with more forestry reviews however uh, the changelog for this is actually quite significant in uh, in a few re for a few reasons <clears throat> first of all let's read the changelog 2.0 overhaul of the complete truck so that's pretty significant although what that exactly means, I'm not exactly sure. However, the next part of the update changed the description and added an explanation of how to unload. Well, this, I must say, is extremely helpful because I literally butchered it to death trying to figure out how to work this thing the first time I reviewed it, and it brought back many bad memories and many nightmares and tossing and turning. However, um, Grapple edited removed automatic log holding system and added more crane cameras. So, first let's find it in the store under vehicles and forestry machines. And here it is, the Manti GX Special, $205,000 up to 880 horsepower, 490 liters of fuel, and 49 miles per hour. <clears throat> As I said, two, uh, three slots for the first one and two slots for each subsequent one. Farm Dog Max is somewhat interested in this, I, apparently, or interested in what I might have dropped on the floor. Now, we have all the usual things, and I don't think anything in here has really changed all that much. We have the... And, let's see, design, wheel designs. Yes, well, we have... Those are pretty much standard for um, this modder um, and then we have stone guard headlight protection yeah all these things I think have not changed and are pretty standard for um, this modder and uh, we, of course we have all the colors in a multitude of the claw color crane color cabin above cabin below sun shield stanchion color rim color and license plate so all these things i will attach my original review at the end of this one to go through all of those things however the important thing of this video is how to get this to go to this now this is what now we have here a uh, well a truck a log hauling truck let's get our help window on here <clears throat> with uh, a few options and so forth and so on but the real question and the struggle i had was how do you get from that to this and that is what i will show you in this video so let's get started and this of course is all thanks to the new description of this mod in the mod hub Right, so, uh, instructions for unloading and unfolding the trailer. Number one, unfold the crane. So, we have to highlight the truck. Truck is highlighted, and then L1 and X. And it will do this. Unfold the crane. Important step, number one. Now, just recall, if you want to get it all back together, just do everything in reverse order. But we will show you this first. Now, number two, control group, switch to the trailer. Okay, let's go. So it's con control group two now, and then now we're on the trailer. Right, control group trailer. Number three, <coughs> uncouple the trailer. So all you have to do is press X. Bam. Right, see? Now it's unattached. Farm Dog Max is not impressed. Um, so now, step number four. Use the crane to lift the trailer by the black strut and place it behind the truck. 
All right, so we're going to zoom in here, and the black strut is this piece right here, of which we are going to L1 and use our crane to position R1, L1 and R1. We're going to spin our, using the L1, R1 and right stick, spin that around, and L1, R1 and right stick down. There we go, and L1 and R1, I believe, uh, no, up and down, there we go, down, there we go, we've grabbed onto it, see that? Now, uh, up, 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 R1 and up, and L1 and right stick, we're going to swing that around, there we go, so now R1 and L1, and right or left we'll spin that trailer around let's get it out a little bit a little bit there we go maybe a little in and spin that around a little bit more and r1 i'm starting to get better at this actually all these all these logging mods of late right so now Let's see if we can just perfectly place this down right, whoops, right here, there. So we placed it there. Now we need to release, no, 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 up. Oh, I hate logging controls, crane thingies. Oh, come on, let go. There we go. Okay, let's, <clears throat> now. Um, couple the trailer. Well, it'll help if you actually L1 and fold the truck. So put the crane away. You don't need the crane anymore right now. So I'm going to add that to the instructions because we can now drive the truck around because the, um, the supports have gone away and we can drive the truck around much easier. So there we go. Attach the trailer. So that's actually couple the trailer number five but yeah put the crane away first but there we go we have attached the trailer now we are far beyond anything that I managed managed before now with the trailer highlighted so not the truck but the trailer highlighted L1 and X unfolds the trailer right so we're starting to get there very nice right so what about the truck well step number seven or no that was seven or no step number seven switch control group to the truck okay yeah that's step number seven step number eight use open cover to position stanchions okay so if we go l1 and we have open cover well we don't have anything but those it's not a tipper trailer so there we go now it basically positions the stanchions right on. I think we've done it. By George, I think we've done it. Now step number nine, having fun. <laughs> I always like it when, you know, instructions have the last instruction is have fun. Um, so there we go. What are our um, options? Well, we have fastened tension belts. We have tension belts on the rear. And L1 and R1 change crews. So, okay, so it uh, one of the other options was added more crane cameras. So let's unfold. Oh, no, 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 no. Unfold the truck. There we go. There we go, unfolding the truck. So we got the crane. We're gonna open the crane back up now that we've got everything opened up and ready to go. Let's have a look at these camera options. So in the truck, that's one camera one, one number one. Second camera is um, this view. Basically, you're sitting in that chair. Uh, beside or sitting in the seat beside the crane that what's that's what it looks like that crane uh, again 
here we are a little bit further back so you can see our head right down at the bottom right there so here we are we're a little bit set back a little bit more so obstructed a little bit by the by that okay and then one more time okay now we're out even a little bit further still can't look around but we are following that crane uh, there and one more time and here we are we are now almost looking directly at the claw the claw and one more time oh we're out here and then here we can spin around we're actually centered on the crane itself rather than the truck that one I might actually like yes that one actually looks better and then one more oh, okay so bam 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 right so that is when the crane is extended <clears throat> now if we fold the crane away <laughs> we can still look at all those let's see if it's uh, if those go away when it's all folded up so we're in cab uh, we no, the, we still get all of those views even if the but now we are more centered on the truck yes all right I think that's got all of them um, yeah so there you go that's the Manti GX Forest special update changelog 2.000 by HR Forst und Frausenbrau 43.4 megabytes to download in only three slots on console I'm not gonna put it back together because once you've taken it apart yeah I never put stuff back together um, <laughs> thanks again to smoke 82 for his request I'm Looney farm guy thank you all for watching and remember it's only a game so till next time bye for now